You're watching just released video that gives a clearer picture of why Yellowstone Park Rangers put down a young bison, a decision that is sparking outrage. The bison made headlines when a tourist put him in the back of an SUV and drove him to a ranger station after finding him shivering and alone. Rangers attempted to reunite the calf with the herd, but the other bison rejected him. All the other ones struggling. Now a tourist has come forward with video showing what happened just before the bison ended up in that SUV. It shows the baby trying to keep up with the herd while crossing a cold and rushing river. It looks like he's doomed, but he struggles to make it to shore, leaving him exhausted and shivering. Go, little buffalo. He's still shaking as he huddles close to a car, seeking to warm himself against the heat of the running engine. Is it any wonder a tourist took pity on him? But animal experts say it was the wrong thing to do. Humans are doing more harm when they intervene with wildlife, trying to save it more harm than good. The tourist, identified as Shamash Kassam from Quebec, Canada, was charged with interfering with wildlife and fined $110. But did the rangers really have to euthanize the bison? I think Yellowstone officials did the most humane thing for this calf. It's a very, very sad story, but it's better than letting this calf starve.